All right, what is up, everybody? I spent one year not washing my hair, and I still haven't washed my hair with um, soap and shampoo. I still use water to uh, run, I still run hot and cold water through my hair at least once per day, sometimes twice, morning and night, or just night. And the reason for that is because I believe soap and shampoo are not needed in specific cases. For example, for me, I don't live in a big city. Um, I get salt water through my hair when I go swimming into the ocean, so I believe I do not need soap and shampoo. Does this mean you shouldn't use soap and shampoo? Potentially, but most people live in big cities or at least near them in polluted areas, in which case I recommend you use soap and shampoo once every month or so. The point of soap and shampoo is to clean out the hair, not to strip away your natural oils and then add those natural oils, add some artificial oils back in the hair. It makes no sense. Um, you're just doing something that's redundant. So here's my experience. I used to have really, really crappy hair. My hair went in every which direction. It was greasy. It was um, unsightly to say the least. And after I stopped using soap and shampoo, my hair became much, much curlier. I'm not sure why. It could be due to puberty. It could be due to not using the soap and shampoo. Um, but I think everybody should at least give it a try. Now here's the thing. The first month, your body is going to don't your body isn't going to know what the hell is going on because you've been using soap and shampoo all your life and your body's become, become accustomed to it meaning it's going to push out extra oils into your hair to supplement for the oils that you stripped away using the shampoo right so the first month your hair will be very very greasy and you may get dandruff uh, even but after that first month that should go away as your body um readjusts to everything so that's the only thing. How I recommend mitigating that aspect of it is to use super hot shower water. That seems to get rid of a lot of the greasiness um, just because that heat heats up that um, like the oily stuff and it comes out with the water just just a bit. So you can remove the excess by using um, like really hot showers and that sort of thing. But um, again, it's not necessarily needed. It's just nice to come out of a shower and not feel super greasy afterward, right? So um, that's how I recommend you going about it. And that's about it, guys. I don't know what else to really say. Just stop using soap and shampoo too often. If you live in a polluted area, use it a little more often than, um, than my, you know, once a month, whatnot. And let me know how your guys' experiences go in the comments um, of this video or over the DMs and the Instagrams, whatnot. Um, and you guys have a good rest of your day. That's about it.